To our graduates, I do want you to remember that you stand on the shoulders of those who just stood in this auditorium. Also those who have come before you to this great university. This is the place where legends are made. And our next set of legends are sitting before me. I'm happy that this day is finally here. Uh, the nerves are gone, everything's gone, but I'm trying to keep it calm. You know, I don't want to trip. You know, I'm not wearing any high heels or shoelaces, but we'll see. Don't mess this up, don't fall, don't trip. <laughs> uh, I'm just excited. Um, I start graduate school in about three weeks, so just kind of getting a little bit of a rest trying to get ready for that, but it's just exciting to actually have one degree at least and be able to work, start working towards the next one. It's bittersweet. Um, I'm happy that it's over, but I'm going to miss the college field, the atmosphere, my peers, the university, football games. I'm going to miss all of it. I just can't believe how fast it went. It went in kind of a blink of an eye, which is weird, but I'm graduating with two of my best friends. The reason why I came back to finish this degree, I love this school. Um, I love what it stands for. I love how progressive it has gotten. Oh, I love it. Yeah, Anytime I get amazing. to brag about Alabama, I always do. I'm always like, oh, you should go. It's so much fun. I've had a blast these last four years. Definitely. So. It's great. It's been a good experience, especially like with the people that I've encountered. My professors have been great. I can't have imagined a better place to have spent my last four years. So just all the people I've met, the classes I've taken, things I've been involved with on campus have been great. Yeah, I'm from California, so everyone's always like, well, why'd you go there? I was like, because it's literally the best school ever. <laughs> like. Yeah, I'm sad to leave. I lost my husband in June of last year. And he knew that this was a desire of my heart. So this is a somewhat of a tribute to him. It's filling a void that um, with something meaningful. It's meaningful to him and it's meaningful.